Well, hello there, guys. It's been quite a while, but we're going to be playing some combat mission today, and of course, we want to listen to what's going on here. So, it looks like elements of the 205th Motorized Fire Brigade have, Rifle Brigade, have withdrawn through the sector to establish new defensive positions. So, our mission is to lead as the vanguard. So, to fix and defeat the 3rd Battalion of the Russian 215th Motorized Rifle Brigade. Our purpose is to maintain contact with the enemy in order to not allow the firm defensive measures to be established. Alright, so we're going to conduct a deliberate assault. Pretty straightforward. Let's get to it, guys. Um, you guys know that I'm pretty much a, a noob in this game, but I always, now and then, try to uh, sort of change things up. So I guess in this one, this is interesting. We're going to have to go through this village. Um, fair enough. So I'm going to go ahead and start moving. I think this is a pretty safe move. I hope so. We've definitely got infantry units in here that could react to whatever we see, but I know there are enemies up there. At least I see barricades, so I'm going to try and be safe. Let's go ahead and take this one as well. We're going to quick move up here to checkpoint 229. And we'll do the same with this Humvee right here. Let's hope this works out, guys. We're going to go for the first turn. Wish us luck. Oh, we didn't move this guy. Oh, 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 we gotta go back and see what just happened. Alright, penetrating hit. Penetrating hit, so there's definitely enemies ahead of us. Did not expect uh, everything to break out so quickly. Here we go. Question is, can we spot them? We are trying to spot. Maybe we actually got a kill here. I'm not sure if that's ours. Yeah, I guess it is. So we actually knocked out one of the uh, infantry fighting vehicles. I don't know how, but it happened. Let's continue. So there we go, guys. Um, so now I'm going to go ahead and start dismounting here. I think that's going to be very important. Uh, let's take a look in here. There we go. What the hell? No, I'm not done. Alright, let's see. Okay, so I guess I am done. Let them move. We started at the beginning, so maybe this time we'll get a little more lucky and we'll get to see the kill. Alright, lucky shot nonetheless. Let's go ahead. And now, finally, let's go ahead and unload. And I'm immediately going to move into this building right here in case we see any uh, enemies. Unload with the machine gun as well. I think we want to get as much firepower as possible with this machine gun. So let's quick move into the building as well, level 2. And with these guys, I think probably a better idea to unload, don't you? I'm going to go ahead and unload these guys as well, or dismount. I keep saying unload. Can't get over it. And we're going to try to put them in this house. Now, again, we're not sure about the enemies in this location, but I'm going to try to play it safe. And this is the only guy I'm actually going to continue forward with uh, towards the enemy location. I can see they have another enemy APC over there. And we are, of course, fighting the Russians here, so... Keep moving forward, guys. Here we go. Get out, man. This team looks pretty capable. We need them in that building, though. Oh boy, they're already firing at us. That happened quickly. Could have taken the other team out, but no. Hopefully we can return fire. Especially with our APC. I want to see if we can get close to that guy. In the meantime, though, it would be nice to actually drop our infantry off maybe in this building here. Have a forward firing position. 
Although I think we're extending ourselves a little too much here. And actually, I'm starting to see that enemy machine gun. So let's go ahead and unload our boys. First, I'm going to have to stop this truck entirely. So we'll stop his movement. Then we will dismount. And now, quick move into this house, level 2. At that point, we hunt. I think we can also keep hunting with this guy right here, but uh, he could probably quick move up to this house. You see there's a little bit of cover here. Hopefully the enemy hasn't found it first. And I'm going to do the same with this APC, although I've learned my lesson. Let's unload this little bugger. Dismount, and we're going to quick move him up to this house. We'll just kind of leapfrog it. Generally, when we play Combat Mission Black Sea, we're not careful at all. This time I'm going to be somewhat careful. Again, somewhat being the key word. Let's go, boys. So we're just kind of trying to get our guys out of here and in safer positions, penetrating it already by the enemy. And there's a spotter in there. Come on, fire, fire. It's a freaking tank. You know, it looks like a tank. No, just an APC. Come on, son. Get a shot. Get a shot. We need the striker, the mobile gun system. Actually, I think that's actually just a six mobile gun system. We totally destroyed that thing. Beautiful shot there. Looks like he's still kind of alive, though. All right, our men are already opening fire on that location. So is the mobile gun system. Looks like the mobile gun system is now firing over here, guys, at the enemy uh, vehicle. Try to take out this second infantry fighting vehicle that the Russians have. I think we're going to have to move this APC forward. He's right now basically focusing on the enemy machine gun, which, hey, that's great. Um, we definitely want to take out enemy MGs, but we've got to focus on the mission. So let's hunt towards the enemy. Now, our guys are trying to get in the building as quickly as they can. Some of them, of course, retreating. Pretty normal. And we'll quick move to this building, level 2. Hopefully, there are no, no tangos in sight. We're going to quick move with this vehicle this way. And I think at this point, we can even start moving these guys as well. Level 2, we're just working our way up, guys. I'll actually even move the Humvee if we can. What? I guess the Humvee can't move, damn it. All right. Let's do it, boys and girls. The mobile gun system does not seem to want to move. I hope it's not immobilized. Although I think it's just lining up for the perfect shot here. There's another APC on the way, guys, from the Ukrainian Police HQ. He's not moving. And penetrating hit. Damn. So this mobile gun thing is the only thing we have that can save us, I think. All right, fair enough. Let's quick move him. I'm honestly not too worried about the armor. The driver's fine. This thing should be able to move. Doesn't look damaged to me in any way. And we'll get some sappers to move up as well. To that same building. They're going to be tired when they get there, but this is worth it, guys. Even the machine gun crew has to get the hell out of here. Get to a more opportune position. Let's hope this works this time. We need more kills. There we go. Come on, he's moving. He's moving. I just hope he doesn't get tagged first. Obviously a very slow vehicle. Come on, come on. There we go, there we go. Oh, taking massive hits, penetrating hit. I don't know if we can get another one off, guys. We're going to have to rely on the infantry now. Hot damn, I was hoping that wasn't going to be the case. Or we can hope that we get some reinforcements now. Oh, we do actually have a uh, ATGM gunner here. Maybe if we get him in this building, maybe he can spot that guy, or maybe even this building. But right now, look at what he's doing to our poor guys. At least we're still getting some shots across the river there. 12 seconds, and we've got all of our men for it. There we go. That's an ATGM. Hey, our guys do have ATGMs. Got to get more infantry forward. There we go. Another one. That is an armor 
skirt hit the armored skirt. I mean, it didn't really do any damage, but it's good to know that our guys know how to fight back against an armored force. And we're just going to have to keep moving everybody forward. It's basically that simple. I don't know why these guys aren't moving. Maybe it's because it's the commander and the driver, and we just got some artillery support, guys. Hell yes. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and actually we need to find a spotter, first of all. But one thing I want to do is get this guy in this building. I hope it doesn't come falling down around us. And these spotters can keep moving forward as well. So, all we got was artillery support. I was hoping for some actual units. And for that, I believe we need some sort of spotter to get the artillery support in. We could try with the sappers. Uh, apparently, we can get a howitzer. Let's go ahead and do an area target. And we can actually see this target. Through two heavy, long... General. Five minutes. It's always best to wait a bit for artillery support, of course. And maybe we'll clear out some of the town while we're at it. Oh boy, that's not our Artie at all. That's definitely not our Artie. That is enemy Artie. Pretty friggin' effective. Come on, guys. Get those rockets. It's really all up to these guys, I think, if we survive this mission. They need to get off some nice shots. There we go. That's one, but it missed. Tension is palpable in this episode, I'll admit that, guys. Come on, boys. And actually, we should get me even closer over here. I think that would be an even better location. Uh, if he doesn't get any hits this time. Right now, we're kind of the ones defending this area when we should be attacking. But without the proper equipment, we're not going to go anywhere. Shit, now they're firing at us. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Well, this guy's going to obviously run out of the house. I'm going to try to get these men into this building, uh, into level 2. I'm basically hoping that this machine gunner can provide some covering fire. So we'll go to level 2 here. Uh, let's see what else we can do. We can pop some smoke. Why not? Help out our boys that are coming up, kind of moving up this uh, particular road. And hope for the best, obviously. Other than that, I'm not really sure what else we can do. Let's go, boys. Into the fray. Alright, finally, so it did say out. I'm not sure if that means if the fire mission is going to commence immediately. That would obviously be ideal, but we'll see what happens. Oh, man, our entire unit got wiped out there. The entire fucking house came crumbling down, guys. It's not a good start. Keep it up, keep it up, get the spotter, get the spotter. So it looks like they've got some nice little cover over here. Our men are getting some decent shots, but we've got to get that other guy badly. And I think we have one ATGM guy still left, but he's in a panic, obviously. Alright, let's go ahead and... Nice, I like to see the machine gun getting some shots off. See if we've actually gotten some hits on the enemy machine gun unit. Oh, he's definitely cowering. I think getting the spotters is going to be the most important thing. We, now we've got actually enemy infantry to deal with. And now we're actually in a proper gun battle. Looks like we may have gotten a few of these. Wow, those guys do not look nice. True Spetsnaz. <laughs> Third Squad A Team. It's just a rifle company. Oh boy. We better hope for a miracle here, guys. I'm not sure if we're supposed to get re like any reinforcements, but they would definitely help in a good time like this. Oh, enemy artillery, or our artillery maybe? Okay, I think it is our artillery, or theirs. It's just very badly placed. Um, let's see if we can get this guy. A quick move into this building. Maybe that's going to make us a big difference. It's all about whether he's willing to go and whether he's got the Stinger missiles, and that's definitely enemy artillery. We're going to get him to move forward. Holy crap. 
major artillery strikes on us right now, guys. We badly need reinforcements, and I hope that he can find the enemy. Okay. Things are nasty. There's no way around it. I'm going to try to get these guys in that building, too. And the same with this one infantryman, the lone infantryman, the assault squad guy. But that much ordnance is just going to wreck us. There's no doubt about it. We can see it coming down. Boom. It doesn't look like this guy can actually see that enemy unit. I don't know if we should move forward or what we should do. I think we should just wait for support. Alright, that might be our artillery. Reinforcements have arrived. Ghost Rider, that's what I was looking for, guys. And it's, please tell me it's not just one gunner. Come on, where, where are these guys? Where are these damn reinforcements? Alright, it could just be the helicopter support, which right now isn't going to do much for us. Especially if we can't see the damn thing. Of course, our men can't call in helicopter support. Not even artillery support. So we're going to have to wait for somebody higher up to move up here, and right now we don't have a single damn person. Keep it up, boys. Fight's not over. Oh, I see the reinforcements now. What a fool. Well, it's something, and there are spotters here, which means we can call an Artie. Um, let's just hope that we can take out the spotter team. I don't think we're going to be taking out that ATGM anytime soon, but we will start moving towards it. So far, no hits on the enemy there. But at least we're holding our position, and at this point, guys, we're going to bring up Ghost Rider. So this thing is... We're going to have to be careful, because we like to get shot really badly by enemy APCs, so I'm actually going to put these guys in the woods to act as an actual Ghost Rider here, and this guy is going to come up um, quickly as hopefully opposition to this APC through the woods once again, but we're going to just hold our sp position here, and let's hope for the best, guys. Our men deserve victory in this one, boys. Come on, get that damn unit. Looks like we're getting some really heavy fire there. Looks like there are two enemy APCs here. I would love to get one of these bastards quickly. Come on, man. You should be able to see that APC. I'm not sure if he can, but he's got he's got one stinger missile. That could definitely go and end that guy's life pretty quickly. There's some more enemy artillery fire. This guy came out quickly. Come on, come on, find some kills. Find some kills, Sonny Jim. All right, well. I think we're going to definitely have to get him to find some kills immediately. And I think he needs to start hunting down this way immediately as well. Um, so right here, I'm going to go ahead and actually drop the boys off. Let me stop the vehicle. And let's unload first. Dismount, wherever you want to put it. And uh, we'll quick move over here. We'll do the same with this guy here. We're going to dismount and quick move. And the same with our spotter. In fact, I might... No, I don't think I'm going to send my spotter there. I'm going to say I might dismount with my spotter and go to that house, but I think it's received enough love and tender care, to be honest with you. So let's quick move you here. And we're going to quick move the APC a little farther up. Let's hope that this thing gets some kills, guys. Come on. Come on, son. You can do it. Should be able to see that target. And they took down another one of our buildings. Wow. It's just merciless firepower. He's 
rattled, but he's not moving forward, and that is a little frustrating. All right, guys. Pretty hardcore, nonetheless. And, uh, well, you guys know how this works. We're going to continue the fight. We're not going to give up. We must continue the fight and avenge these fallen men. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to smash that like button. We're going to try to get a kill here um, in the next video, of course, with this beautiful self-propelled gun. And I'm hoping that we kill at least one of those damn APCs to allow our men to move up. I mean, there's three in total, and we've got to get at least a kill on one. Uh, but thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, smash that like button. And, of course, subscribe if you haven't already. And please, share the channel and also join me on VidMe, guys. It's not easy. It's not, it's not hard to sign up. Anybody can do it. And uh, thank you so much.